their legs. We season them for about an hour with coarse salt and fenugreek. Fenugreek just gives a little bit more depth, more savouriness to the meat itself. The salt, it just firms up the flesh a little bit. Once it's washed off, we simply put the rabbit in a tray, add a little bit of garlic oil and bake it in the oven, just a medium temperature around 150 degrees for an hour. After which time, you let it rest a little bit. For the sauce for the pie, it's just a light, light filling. We just bring the buttermilk to the boil, blend in some butter, a little bit of lemon juice, a pinch of salt and some chopped garlic, and that's the filling. Chop the meat up, you've got nice big chunks, and uh, any juice that comes out of the rabbit, we then add that to the sauce. Then the other components of the dish, Jersey Royal new potatoes. And we just cook them in equal parts salted and unsalted butter, and they absorb all the butter, they confit, and yeah, just really, really rich. Using English broad beans in the height of summer, and we just blanch them in rapidly boiling salted water for about 30 seconds, and then we refresh them in ice water, and then pod them out of the shell. The mushrooms, it's fine to go either Girol, Morel, Chanterelle, St. George mushrooms, whatever's in season. Sweet corn, we steam it with salted butter for about half an hour, and then just with a knife, take it off the husk. Chervil, you want to chop it not too fine. It's nice having big chunks of herb in there. Presentation-wise, it's quite nice serving the pie with a little carrot poking out the top. For this, buy some medium-sized carrots with the stem still on. Just chop them off to about an inch, peel the carrot, season it very lightly, and then we just bake it in a medium oven underneath some tin foil. That way it steams. You then fill the pie dishes, a nice mix of the, the chunks of the rabbit and all the other ingredients, and then top it up with the sauce. Lids for the pie is really straightforward. Have a sheet of puff pastry on your worktop. Take the pie dish that you're going to serve, stick that on the pastry, cut around it, place the lids on top, and you just stick them to the side of the pie dish, just using a thumb. We then brush the lids with a little bit of egg wash, and then make a little incision in the middle of the, the pastry. We just place the carrot in there. Key tip before putting them in, you just want to wrap a little bit of tin foil around the stem of the carrot. That'll just stop it from charring. Get the pies on a baking tray. Again, you want a little bit of space between them so the air can circulate. Preheat the oven to 190 degrees, ideally a fan assisted oven for 20 25 minutes. The pastry will rise up, carrots will colour a little bit, and then pull them out. And you want to let them sit for about five to ten minutes. You don't want to serve them straight away, they'll be piping hot, doesn't really need any, any garnish. You've got greens in there, you've got potatoes, you've got carrot. It's good to go, it's a meal in itself.